All right, so uh, over the next couple of streams, those pictures are the new Among Us, I guess. Kind of. It, it's a trend right now because they're – it's just fun. You throw a phrase in and you see what it creates. So uh, let me just find a little bit of uh, background music. And we'll just do a quick run through. Uh, I don't know. Let's do uh, – Donk, uh, Diddy Kong Racing OST. I like that. I like those musics. That's royalty free. Oh shit. I gotta turn off my speakers or you're gonna get some sick echo. There we go. Okay. So. You find the old folder of bullshit. So these are all ones, I believe these are all ones that I generated. There might be the odd one that uh, Jake or Nick generated in here, because they did some really funny ones too. But I just imported all my ones uh, off on the phone, uh, off of my phone. So uh, these ones I did before we went away, and they're just sort of like some test ones to see what I could get. So I actually used some of these uh, in our... Uh, our picture that we did, one of our thumbnails, uh, for the moving out thumbnail, I used, uh, one of these rats. So, these are, uh, a mafia boss that is a rat in a realistic style. So, I, I didn't, it didn't really do the realistic style all too well, really. Looks all very cartoony, but I really like the middle right one that we got there. He's in, like, a little suit. And bottom right's really good. He got some weird rat man, you know? Bottom, middle, middle is weird shit. But, uh, you know, that, that's an example. You put the words in, and the, it just fucking generates it. It's nuts. And if you go, if you look up Doll E2, like, this is, like, the shittier version of this technology. There's an extremely good version that's under work. Uh, I don't know how public it'll be. Uh, Nick Cheese's waifu is Sinon from Sword Art Online, so I did a lot of these to spite him. Uh, this one was Sinon eating McDonald's with Johnny Depp. So it, it really doesn't do faces good. Like, it tries to construct faces, but it fucking can't. Like, like the Sinon one, you got like some of these big circles, and Johnny looks like his face has been punched in. But you can kind of see like the bottom left, there's like a Happy Meal or something there, maybe. Like, you know, you know, it tries its best. But you get some that turn out better than others. Um, like these were a few that I particularly liked. I thought that looked pretty good. I have like a little date. And then we got like this one here. He looks kind of like he's like hug hugging her or something. Like I said, I know that there is a sentient AI now, so that's a thing. Sentient AI? That's fucking scary. Uh, this was Super Mario being served a big plate of spaghetti by Guy Fieri. Uh, so it mostly just got Guy Fieri as the kind of first person. I guess you're the Mario. The only one that really has Mario in it is the upper right, and it looks like Guy Fieri's head is a meatball. So, some weird shit here. Good spaghetti, though. Makes me feel kind of hungry looking at that spaghetti. But, uh, you know, Guy Fieri looks like Guy Fieri. <laughs> well, let me, let me throw my fingers in this. Oh. Oh, thanks. Here, Mario, have a nice big bowl of spaghetti. Don't worry, I washed my hands before I licked them. <laughs> <coughs> oh, guys, this is not what I had in mind. Oh, when, when Mario said he was gonna give me head, I know he was gonna like, decapitate me. Oh, no. Uh, this is just hamburger made of gold. Uh, it turned out really good. Like, yeah, it's a hamburger made of gold. Uh, sometimes the simpler ones actually, like, generate a, a usable image. Like, this, some of this looks like pop art, clip art that I could use. Uh, what have we got next? Ah, this is a leprechaun working as a Dell technician. Uh... I like how he's got like a laptop when he's opened it up, but the leprechaun faces are pretty cursed if you look real close at them, but they tried to give him a laptop to work on, so it looks like maybe a monitor up in the middle and like a desktop behind them. Yeah, the bottom middle one is a little... Bottom middle one looks like, um, remember the mascot for Honeycomb? 
kind of the middle left there too. You know, I want honeycomb. Give me honeycomb. Give me honeycomb. Uh, let me see if I can pull up a picture of them. Uh, honeycomb cereal demon. I don't know. That'll probably. <laughs> There he is. There's this uh, crazy, ugly motherfucker. Oh, yeah, fuck. Um, I don't know what's a good. This is like the best picture of him here. Let me just save this. Oh, it's saved as a web P. Fuck. Save as a pinge. Web penis. And let's just drop that. What do I have open? I have the Dolly mini folder open. Okay, whatever. I'll just put this in here as honeycomb demon. And let me just like let's do a little side by side here. Where's this motherfucker? Yeah, so kinda like this guy. You know what I mean? Oh, there's so many things to try to click and, and select. Well, oh, it's because the broken monkey was here. Uh see like this sort of like the same face. It's got like that fur coming apart, you know, like the very, very similar. Lego, yeah, yeah, it's finally happened. There's a video on it. I didn't watch it though, because there's enough going on in the world for me to worry about. Well, I just know it's legit and a serious problem going on in the background. For sure. And just so you know, Chris, uh, I hope Chris is coming in okay, because she's going to sound like she's sort of in the background. Let me move the mic maybe here, in between us both, because then it'll do like a better, maybe a better between the two of us. But just let me know. Uh, definitely not used anymore. Uh, let me just rearrange how I'm doing this slightly. Let me do like a new scene. Oh no, I don't want to do a new scene. Oh shit. Um. Uh, uh, Actually, I don't even need video capture device on this, uh, most, like, get it out of my way. Yeah, okay, cool. Alright, so, back to the main event here. Uh, oh, I did this one. This was Shaq in the style of an Obama campaign poster. And these came out really nice. Like, when you get it to do something really stylized, it does a lot better because then it doesn't need to do like the, the details on the face. Because you can see whenever it does the detail on the face, you get like top middle where you got like Sans Shack Terminator or some shit. But these ones that are more stylized, like bottom middle looks good. Like and top left, that looks pretty good too. You got some hand basketball action going on there, but is leprechauns and leprosy related? No, leprosy is a deadly disease where like your body falls apart. And a leprechaun's like an Irish folklore thing. I don't think they're related at all. I, I, I think they're just... I, are leprechauns real? No. Related to leprosy. Uh... Oh. Oh shit. Never mind, they are. Oh, fuck. Leprechauns are not native Irish. Leprechaun is not a native Irish word. Uh, leprechauns may be considered quintessentially Irish, but research suggests the perception is blarney. The word leprechaun is not a native Irish one. We have uncovered hundreds of lost words from the Irish language and left the secrets of many others. Although leprechaun has been in the Irish language for a long time, it's just say it comes from leopard luparcy, a uh, group linked to a Roman festival, or luperky, I don't know. Uh, some of the feast, the ritual, swimming, uh, old Irish tale, uh, sleeping Fergus at the sea, yada yada yada, checking etymologies, yada yada yada, doop -a -doop -a -doo. where's the part where it has something to do with leprosy? Um, we do a little control F on this article, leper. Oh, 
Is this just some guy in the comments? He said, The unfortunate story began in 1438 when Sean, who was a very short man, was found to discover, uh, develop leprosy. Sean the leper, or leper Sean as some called him, uh, is what's said to have caused the confusion. Back when entertainment was sparse for the poor, imaginations ran rampant and rumors became twisted. Leper Sean became Leprechaun, and omitting the leprosy focused instead on his stature. The rest is history. I don't know how accurate that is, that's just some guy in the fucking comments, but... You know. Amusing. <laughs> Amusing nonetheless. Uh, here we got some sewer rats! Uh, this is a sinkhole in New York full of rats! I don't know if you remember the stories of, like, sinkholes where, like... I don't know, there was, like, a guy, he was, like, waiting for his bus, and all of a sudden a sinkhole opened up underneath him, and it was full of rats! Well, I thought maybe we could create that, and, yeah, big holes are full of rats! Sounds familiar. Yes, it's, it was a uh, it was a brief thing, but apparently they do happen. Every now and then the floor just opens up and rats are there. Uh, this was Goku in the style of a Smash Brothers new challenger. This was kind of still when I was like just seeing what it could do. Like you see again, no faces. Get to Goku's face. You do his body. You do his hair. You need his Super Saiyan Goku, and you can see they're kind of putting him on Battlefield or some shit. Uh, but no face. No no touchy. Uh, what have we got next here? What's this shit? Oh, this was bored apes working at Burger King. It, it just did like literal apes working at Burger King. I like this one in the middle right. That's a real bro getting looking monkey. The middle one's got like a, a tray maybe. Is what to go eat. Bottom left, it's got a, a split screen going on. That was sitting on the fucking counter. So that's, that was a, that was a thing. Oh, there, then I did Ape NFT working at Burger King. And then NFT, it really understood, meant shitty drawing. You can probably just generate your NFTs out of these programs. I, I like the realistic burger next to the one in the first square. Uh, but you got some different styles of apes, you know, there's some monkey. The one on the top right looks like it could be a doctor. Hmm. Okay, what else have we got? What's this? Uh, oh, so it's like Shovel Knight armor. I think I did it in the style of like a technical drawing, I think I did. Or like a concept or, or, or something like that. It turned out pretty good. I, I like this one just for the accuracy. It was like, yeah, this looks like some concepts of the Shovel, the shovel Knight. It's got swords though, no, no shields. Shovels. Shovel shields. I mean, the one in the top middle looks like he has a dick. Top middle one does look like he has a bit of a penis, yes. Uh, Lego said there's a lot of people getting their face sucked off by the Kraken for parts of the Caribbean vibes. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah there really is. It doesn't do faces good. Uh, this was Robotnik and Sinon at a fancy Italian restaurant. Like, you get Middle left is fucking scary looking. I don't know what's going on there. Some fucking... I don't like that sit on. Uh, but you can see, like, it's trying. Like, it's got the colors of Robotnik there. It kind of looks like the Incredibles, almost. Mm. Top left sit on's got a bad hair day. Bottom right, they just did the fancy Italian restaurant. They're like, fuck it, no horror show here, just food. Uh, like, the Shovel Knight one in the middle right looks like he's holding a dripping coffee. You know, do mm. you know what? It, for shovelry. Mm. Oh, this was. Shovel it to. His girlfriend, real good. So I'm trying to remember a lot of these prompts. I think this was something like Tony Stark inventing the blockchain in the metaverse. And I like it has all these like blues and glowing fucking things going on. So I, I, I was pleased with that. I was like, yeah, it looks like. It looks it. like Sally from the Nightmare Before Christmas in the bottom left. Just in the background, he's like, look, this. Oh, this was just one for Nick. Uh, again, another one for fucking Sin on there. I did Shino playing GameCube, but it took Shino from Naruto, and it put him in a GameCube game. Like, you can see it's got like sort of GameCube level graphics, and it, like it tries to make like a UI, and I thought that was kind of... It wasn't what I expected, but it was interesting that it can interpret it like that. Uh, oh yeah, then I, I actually got it to be Sinon, still sort of same idea. Oh shit, I just deleted it out of my actual computer. There we go. Um, 
this one. Oh, it's a Squidward with a big butt. Only the bottom middle one really tried to do the big butt, I think. The rest just did some really, like, uh, watercolory baby painting Squidwards. Thanks. Ooh, I'm getting a bad pain in my elbow. Oh, here comes the morgue. So, we watched Morbius over our break. Uh, we had pain over one night before the in-laws came up. And throughout the movie, I just kept generating different Morbius ones. So this was Morbius riding a skateboard in the style of comic. And I'm just gonna like quick fire through these ones because there's a lot of fucking more. Just like it's it's morbid time. Let me put it that way. Uh, this was Morbius as a scientist with vials of blood. I think that was happening in the movie. Uh, we got oh Morbius hugging a child in the style of vaporwave. That's because in the movie there was like this kid he was trying to help, and he like really cared about the child, and I was like, I want to put that in, I want to interpret that in Vaporwave. Style of Vaporwave does some nice shit, it always gets like the grid the and the sun. Of, or in the middle, the very middle or whatever it looks like, it's like, alright, Mama Morbius is gonna give me some titty milk. Morbius is time to feed. <laughs> Little oh, Morbius! Baby. Time Little... to drink from the Morbity! Yeah... God fucking damn it. Baby, you will have new meaning of Morbin time. Oh, this was Morbius and Mike Myers eating at Sonic drive through Um... Uh, I like middle left, because you kind of see them both. And... I guess top right looks sort of more like a clown, but they're kind of there eating, you know? Middle right looks pretty good, it looks like a movie still or something. Some good shit in there. Nah, pretty terrifying either one. Oh yeah, like, I, I took some of my favorites here. Like, I thought that one was pretty cool. Yeah, every now and then I did a few screenshots of my favorites, but after a while it's like... Once you zoom them in, they're so low quality, like... Like, Jared Leto here looks like a fucking rat man. I love it though. Oh yeah. That's the best part. Uh, I'm not actually a vampire. That's how we got by the comics code. I'm actually a rat man. Okay, I gotta scroll down this windows to get in here. Alright. Uh, this was Morbius fighting Michael Myers, and I think I did it in the style of a horror poster. And it, it did like a really cool style with it, and it really got Mike Myers. Michael Myers. Not a lot of more, but a lot of Michael Myers. Uh, I tried to do an NFT fucking board eight out of uh, Morbius, and I like that middle one. Looks kind of like Spawn. That top right looks pretty good, and I think the top middle's trying to do it. Bottom middle's doing some kind of other eight bit poop crap, but you know, not not bad, not bad. Uh, I tried to do it in the style of a Wojak meme, and I don't know if I really quite got what I wanted, but I really liked whatever it tried to do with the top left. Like, something of that made me real happy. Like, a lot of these early ones are me playing around with, like, what it can do. Oh yeah, I tried to do early computer render, only really... Like, the, the middle left one looks like he could be in RuneScape, but the rest of them I didn't really try. And keep in mind, this is all doing comic Morbius, because that's what it, like, interprets. But Donkey Kong as Morbius, the middle one's pretty good, I like that. That middle one's really nice. See, they tried to do something with his face, and, like, they made him kind of gray. The rest of them are just fucked up Donkey Kongs. Uh, what we got here? Morbius drinking new Coke. I like how this one actually did movie Morbius, for whatever reason. And it looks more like he's just drinking blood. Uh, oh, the middle right one, it's just a guy drinking a Coke. Like, it's not Morbius at all, but we got the Coke part. I don't know, uh, some of these, like, the middle one looks like he's supposed to drink out of, like, a gourd. I uh, the bottom left, he's really into that. He's like, oh, give me that drink. Give me that drink, boy. What's this shit? Oh, yeah, I tried to make him ride Yoshi. It, it didn't work. 
produce some fucking messes. Uh, Yoshi's riding him on the top left, kind of in the middle left. But it did not do you. It's not very good with Yoshi, I find. That's not like Yoshi. Morbius as a robot. Some good ones here, actually. Like, uh, his head's cut off, but bottom left is nice. And top left is sort of a little more pots and pansy. But, uh, you know, not terrible. Oh, this was Morbius as a zebra. I like middle left and top middle, those turned out pretty good, they gave him the, the comic cape. Yoshi regurgitated, yeah, like he's a fucking splatter, whatever I do Yoshi. Uh, top right here is really fucked, it's like half zebra, half Morbius, and a real fucking cluster fuck. Uh, what's next here, what we got on the docket? Oh, hang on, I put Morbius as a zebra, and Morbius is a robot. Oh, Morbius in the style of Hotel Transylvania. Yeah, th this one, top middle is really good. You know, he does not say blah blah blah. And, and, and bottom left is pretty good. Middle left is like the, the more, more Morbius, the less Transylvania. Like, I, I really respect how this one turned out. It, it really got a good best of both worlds, I think, on some of them. Well, Morbius on the cover of FIFA. You got soccer balls. You know, and the top, the top left looks pretty good. Looks like a fucking stadium is behind it or some shit. Like, definitely got the soccer ball up. In, in the top middle, it's like Morbius is kicking the ball into some guy's head. Like, he's fucking slammed him with a soccer ball. He's hey, taking look, over the cover. Picasso. Oh, yo, if you do, like, in the style of Picasso, too, like, again, because it doesn't do faces well, when you put it into distorted styles, like, it does pretty well. This is Morbius in the style of The Last Supper, so you can see, yeah, like, you know, it's, it, it knows what The Last Supper looks like. It still can't quite do people, but uh, it puts Morbius in the middle, and, like, Morbius is Jesus, and there's some, like, in, uh, inanimate uh, objects around him. Yeah, I freak out if you do something in the style of regurgitated Picasso. Uh, you know, we can try some out uh, as I'm going here. So you know what, let me open the AI up, and I'll throw some prompts in while we're watching these. So let's do Morbius eating a cheeseburger at 7-11 in the middle of the night. The street is dark and the glow, oh glow, of the 7 11, no, that's too specific, hang on. In the middle of the night, I'm thinking that I want it to look realistic. In the style of regurgitated Picasso. Legos Drawn. and mummies. So that's gonna work, and we'll check in on that shortly. So, uh, next on our list is Morbius eating a big ravioli. <laughs> And this one turned out pretty good. You got some real Morbius and you got some comic Morbius, but either way, he's got a big ravioli in the middle right there. He's going, got the, on his tongue. Got, got a dagger tongue. He's going right to bring it in. Middle bottom, he's like some kind of demon monster there, but he's still got a big ravioli. But I think top left and middle right are the, the two best ones in this. And then you got, what's this? Oh, Morbius in a sinkhole full of bats. Uh, just kind of did sinkholes with bats. Didn't really get the more. What do we got here? Oh, so give Jake. Give me the formioli. Yes, ravioli, ravioli. Give me the morbioli. Um, Jake found out this genius thing where if you put in Jared Leto or Leto, however he may be called, as Morbius, then it's more likely to do movie Morbius. So, uh, I did Jared Leno, uh, Leno as Morbius eating like a 10 scoop ice cream cone. And didn't really get all the scoops, but he's, he's eating the ice cream cone. Definitely looks like him. I don't like, I don't like the middle height. It looks like he porcupined himself in the mouth. Middle right, yeah, he looks like he has a disease. Mm. I like top left, it's real happy. Uh, so this was Jared Leno as Morbius drinking from a coconut in the style of Vaporwave. And uh, some of them look good. The bottom right did Jared Leto as the Joker, but uh, 
you know, or if you gotta have some... It's not, it doesn't think like we do. Uh, I really like how middle left is like realistic vaporwave and not art like it usually does. I think top left is also doing the Joker. I think that's like the... It's sort of got the Joker hair and then the Morbius hair over top of it. Like, you didn't know which one to do. Oh. Uh, it, so I'll tell you right now, it didn't know how to do Regurgitated Picasso. It just, uh, it just sort of did live. It, well, I think you put too much prompt in. No, no, if you put lots of prompt, it doesn't really mess things up. I mean, I can reduce the prompt. I'll get rid of the 7-Eleven part, I'll just put Morbius eating a cheeseburger. But I'll add Jared Leto as Morbius. And let me just do a quick, uh, I guess paint, crop, save, and let's get into the old Dolly. Lito, eat the, or, uh, no, it's more burger. Let me show you how that turned out. So that was, that was how this prompt turned out. So I was Morbius eating a cheeseburger at 7-Eleven in the middle of the night in the style of regurgitated Picasso. But I'm gonna try another one. I, I really like the bottom right. It's really going to eat that cheeseburger. I, I'm really hungry, you know? Oh my god. That's, that's some good <laughs> shit. I love how, I, like, I don't know what he's holding, but, but the middle left looks like he's really contemplating it. The middle left, he looks like a cosplayer. I love he's it. just like, hmm, what is a cheeseburger? Oh, shit, I, I lost my place. Uh, do this one? Yeah. Oh yeah, this was Jared Leno as Morbius swooping in Dire Dire Box. Top right looks like regurgitation. I would look back at that. This one just got him, like, struggling to swim. Uh, top right? Yeah, he does look like he's regurgitated. He looks like he's got his finger down his throat. Yeah, like he's about to fucking throw. Maybe that's what it did. It's some regurgitation in it. Because it doesn't always know exactly what you mean. Except he threw up a boot. Oh, this one. So here's how the, the regurgitated Picasso, when I did the Jared Leto prompt this time, it like exclusively did like Jared Leto as the Joker. Uh, as Morbius. Ooh. So, just do a little, uh, save as Picasso Morbid Burger. So, let me show you how this one turned out. Got a little extra down there, but that was, uh, Jared Leno as Morbius eating a cheeseburger in the style of regurgitated Picasso. So, I don't know, because this is what it thinks Regurgitated Picasso looks like. Like, it, it does its best. Based it's on what information it's demon fuel on the top left. A lot of, a lot of this is going to be demon fuel on the top left. Yeah, demon's going to be eating well in the night. Uh, fuck. Where were we? We were at, like, holy oh, shit, I didn't even here. Right, this one. Oh shit, I put it in the folder. Hang on. Okay. Oh, this was Jared Leto on, as Morbius on a date with Sinon in the style of stained glass. So, I, I like some of this. I like top right. Top right fused them. You got like a, a vampire Sinon there. Oh, yeah, no Picasso cool. in any, yeah, I know. Nah, it didn't really do Picasso at all. It can do Picasso. I think if you just say Picasso. It looks like at the bottom left, she's like consoling him. It's like, sorry about Dave, really. I got You're doing all right. So we're out of the morgue now. This is yeah. Bowser with a side of beer at Oktoberfest. It just sort of did Bowser, but like really fucked up face again. Cannot do faces. Body doesn't look too bad, but it cannot. So you got stung life. by a bee in the like middle right. Like he got fucking crushed by a thwomp. But he's got the beer, he's got the style of the beer. Bottom, uh, top right I can tell is like that artwork of Bowser that they use a lot where you have the one claw in the air. It's like heavily based off of that one. Uh, what do I hear? Oh, Michelangelo eating pizza in the style of Minecraft. Like, I think a lot of these I was just testing like different styles. So I was like, I wonder if style of Minecraft works. I'll throw something in. 
He even tries to make the GUI and shit again, just like what it did with uh, in a whatever kind of game. So I really tried to do that. Uh, what we got here? Oh, this is Donkey Kong with a big bowl of biscotti. You know, I like how he just lifted it up on the bowl and the top of it going for it, you know. His tie kind of comes becomes a cape sometimes. Some interesting. I like shit, the you know. bottom right. He's like, yeah. I like the bottom middle. He's like, is it okay for you now? He's asking permission from Mummy Kong. Mm. And Bumsy. Well, this is Joe Biden that reveals what he's hiding. Uh, there was one particularly I like here. Apparently, he's hiding the fact that we're gonna have like uh, no. Uh, I swear I did one where he's. In any of the United States. I swear I had one where he had like his finger up to his lips, but it's not that one. That one just kind of sucks. Oh sucked. god, his blue teeth in the bottom right. Oh, this is Captain Lou Albano as Mario in Hell Before He Dies in the style of stained glass. So it's got the Captain Lou, and then every now and then it's got the Mario. It, it really fuses Captain Lou with Mario. It doesn't actually take like. It looks like Hagrid in the, the bottom show. left. Uh, yeah, it does look very Hagrid there. Uh, I kind of want to do. Um, I should have done Mario in the style of the Super Show or something and see if that did it better. But that was my attempt to get Super Show. Oh yeah, that was just Captain Lou Albano as Mario in Hell. Uh, I really like the bottom left, it's just like we got to the fuck up. Top left looks good too, like he's just been inflated. Uh, middle's fucking scary. Uh, what do we got here? Oh, it's just Guile using Sonic Boom to break down a door, which he often does in the Street Fighter cartoon. Um, but it kind of, like, confused Guile. It got a little bit of Guile, and then it took Sonic Boom as, like, Sonic the Hedgehog. And I like how Bottom Middle has, like, Sonic back-to-back -back with, like, this Guile Sonic OC. But it's, like, really, like, distorted. No oh, hell, yeah, I know. It's very, it doesn't always grab the parts I want. Some of them are very cool. Some of them are like, yeah, it could've been better. Uh, this is Sonic eating a uh, nice healthy salad in the style of Avatar. Didn't really get the Avatar, got the salad. Got the nice healthy salad. It does not do Sonic characters well, by the way. Like, again, it can't do faces, so when you try to do Sonic characters, it just fucking... Oh no, the middle left looks pretty good. It's sometimes, but it really butchers them a lot. But the top middle looks like fucking Sonic EXE. This is Avatar movie poster in the style of Vaporwave. These actually look pretty good. Like, they're they're very abstract, but... Like, I don't know, I could see this uh, with a little more of a Looks like he's doing some jazzer size in the bottom middle. In the style of kids drawing on the fridge. You know what? Let's do that. Let's do... Let's do... Mario in Hell Before He Dies in the style of... A kid's, a children's drawing. Don't let that run. Because I'm pretty sure it can do that, but I've never tested it. This is just JJ the jet plane in the style of vaporwave. Remember that motherfucker? Remember Thomas the tank engine in the air? He looks even more cursed than the original one. It just, again, it can't do faces, so it's got these like fucking abominations. On these air, the middle one is the only safe one. Every other one would kill you in your sleep, for sure. Uh, what's this? Also, Shrek with Sora in the style of Kingdom Hearts. Try. Yeah, I can see the blobs, how they look like Shrek, how they look like Sora. I like how top right he's sort of got like, his arm around them, like, you know, like their buddies. Uh, and bottom right he's like giving them a noogie, you know? Uh, you know, let's try. I know when I did these ones, these were when we were waiting at the airport. I had literally nothing else to do. Uh, this was Durr Burger in the style of Spongebob. It really made some nasty patties. So, so in case you don't know, the Durr Burger is the Fortnite Burger. If you do Fortnite Burger, it doesn't work. You gotta do it by the actual name. That's why it's got like the eyes and it's trying to do like the tongue. But yeah, it's just some real nasty patties. The middle right looks kind of like a fucked up snail. It's just a loot llama in vaporwave style. 
did that pretty well. Some of them are just normal llamas. Bottom left is like perfect. Like bottom left is just that's it. Like that's what I asked for. Uh, the rest of them are sort of just its own interpretations. Uh, yeah, so Mario uh, in Hell in the style of the children's drawing. You got Mario, but it didn't do Hell. Uh, maybe I do Mario in Purgatory. I'm gonna do Mario uh, screaming in the fires of Hell. In the style of children's drawing. Because those ones, it, it did, it definitely did Mario in the style of children's drawing, but he looked a little too good, and it didn't have the Hell. Uh, what's this? Oh, this is Reptire stepping on Wonder Bread ASMR. So I guess like the top left, those are supposed to be the bread. I like how he's giving thumbs up. I actually had uh, a Reptire toy where uh, he was one of the it was one of those spark toys, so that when you ran him along the floor. There looked like there was spark shooting out of his mouth, but it was carefully like encased. So I you know. I had a toy like that, but it wasn't Reptar. I had a Whiz Pig from Diddy Kong Racing, and his rocket was like it had that effect on it. You know, it's pretty cool because the Diddy Kong Racing music is playing that I can bring it up. But it was a really cool figure. But I was a kid, so I played with it really rough. I think I lost the rocket and the whiz pig. I think he's still somewhere, but he's like really badly scuffed and he's got like markings on him and shit. Cool fucking toys though. Those things were so neat. Uh, this is Donkey Kong in the style of the Vitruvian Man. Uh, top, the top three really tried to do it. The bottom ones, like, I, I can kind of see it bottom left, sorry, middle left, but the rest of them, it's like a stretch. But I really like how it did some of those. Oh, this is Donkey Kong in the style of the Mona Lisa. Middle left, I really like. It didn't do his face too well, but I see the effort. I see what it went for, and it really tried. Uh, top left kind of did too in like some kind of 8-bit poop crap style. Like, I don't know really what it's doing there, but, uh, you know, it tried. Oh, okay, I got Mario. Oh, shit, this time it worked. I don't know if it really looks like a children's drawing, but this, this turned out much better though, so I'm gonna, I'll take it. Hang on. Hold on, gamers. Let's put this sucker up here. Mario in hell. And then... Okay. So, let me get rid of Donkey Kong for a second. And... Yeah, so... Mario screaming in the fires of hell in the style of the children's drawing. So I, I had to really specify what I wanted hell to look like, and then it, it, it tried to do it. So you can see it's sort of like pencil drawing. You see? It's not like, oh, I wonder if I do like crayon. Oh, I do no. the style of crayon. The, um, the first two are pretty good, and the middle one is good. I definitely see like the fires of hell, and Mario looks like he's screaming. No, no, it looks like a children's drawing. They, they might be a like, It's a little abstract. It's a little yeah. too abstract. Yeah, but, but kids again, are that's pretty abstract. Uh, let me just change it to in the style of a crayon drawing. Let's see what that does. And while it's generating that, it, it's generating them a lot faster on my computer, mind you. Um, let me go back to where we left off. So we're at Donkey Kong Picasso. Donkey Kong Mona Lisa, right? Where is that? Okay, right here. So next is Jared Leto, and Mo as Morbius as the Morbalisa. Mor the Morbalisa? The Morbalisa? This one did really well. Like, this one's fucking spot on. Like, nearly all of these looked like what I wanted. Y you got him in, like, normal mode, and then you got middle left where he's, like, full-on Morbin. <sighs> middle right's the only one where it got kind of fucked, but all of these other ones, it looks like him as the Mona Lisa. Like, I'm... I'm really pleased with how these turned out. Uh, let's see. Oh, this was Diddy Kong in the style of the screen. So, the top left, top middle, and middle are the only ones where it actually tried to insert Diddy Kong. 
but I feel like top left is pretty good. Like, it, it looks like the background for the screen, and that kind of looks like Diddy Kong there. Again, with the way the screen looks, how it's really abstract, I feel like that's a really good prompt for it too. I think this is the only time I've used it though, but that's a really good one to throw in if you want to like throw your favorite character in there, in that style. Oh, this was the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles eating pizza in the style of The Last Supper. So top left is the only one that really gets The Last Supper well. Uh, middle left, you see we have some new turtles. Like, there's, I think there's seven turtles in this photo. So, other ones, there's like particular amounts of turtles, but top left is like, the, I think there's one of four even in that. But I'm pretty pleased with how that one turned out too. Even if a bit more abstract. Oh, this is Jared Leto as Morbius skateboarding, so you know, a little more morbid there. I like how we got some like legit Jared Leto Morbiuses. I think top left kind of looks like them. I guess you kind of see him skateboarding in the top middle as well. Some weird shit going on in half the photo, but in the left half, like, you see Morbius and that looks like a skateboard below him, like he's doing an ollie, not an ollie, but like a kickflip or some shit. Uh, and then all these other pictures are just like generic skateboarding, and then just Morbius right up with the camera. Maybe that's a half pipe behind him, I couldn't say. Oh, here we got Kermit the Frog in Evangelion. I don't know what I put as the style for this one. I think maybe I did in the style of anime. I, I top left is pretty good. He's like combined with Ava 1 there. The rest of them is just kind of like weird Kermit the Frogs, but top left sort of did what I wanted. Oh, fuck the crayon. Oh my god. Oh shit, this is good. Hang on. This is so good. This turned out absolutely... This is even better than the last Mario. This is so much better. Mario in hell. Ooh. This one is... This fucking takes the cake. Now, it's not like a kid's crayon drawing. It's like a detailed crayon drawing. But, holy shit. Look at the fucking middle left. The middle left looks so good. Doesn't have the M on his hat, but other than that, like... A top right looks like a good kid's drawing. And, and top left actually looks kind of like a kid's... Yeah, they're not too bad. It's pretty close to what we want. But dude, like that... That middle one there? Like, that's pretty fucking good. I really like that. I love how he's like orange, like the flames are glowing. But like, there's a lighting... They took detail in the lighting, how it would look. For him to be bathed in flame. Like, <laughs> you know, MAMA! That's some good shit. So, that, that exact prompt is in the style of a crayon drawing. Ah, uh, shit, where were we? Go past the morbs. Uh, this was more of a skateboarding for the frog here. What's this one? Oh, this is Chuck E. Cheese in the style of uh, Junji Ito. He's uh, a famous mangaka, uh, a manga artist that does a bunch of horror shit. And uh, did a pretty good job. Got some fucked up Chuck E. Cheese in the top left, top middle. Uh, his style is very abstract and got lots of swirls and shit in it too. So it, it does well with this machine, where it doesn't really do proper like faces and shit. So it just adds to the effect of these like abominations. Like all new Chuck E. Cheese. Oh, this is Jared Leto as Morbius with Kermit on The Muppet Show. Uh, what I like about this one is you got some like ones with just him interviewing him, and then like, like top right, he's like Kermit the Frog's doing some Jay Leno shit, with, like just a big Morbius. But then you've got ones like middle left where it just made like vampire Kermit, and like bottom middle where you got like some kind of fucked up vampire Kermit. Uh, and then bottom left, it tried to do Morbius as a puppet, like, like as an actual Muppet version of Morbius, and it's just like Saw. Like, zoom in on that one, like, that's fucking cool. I love when it makes Muppets out of people. It, it does that sometimes, it just turns people into Muppets, and that's fucking good. Like, Kermit looks terrible, but that Morbius Muppet, like, that's some good shit. Let's see, um, let me turn my volume down a little more. 
just in case it's a bit loud on you. Uh, what's next on our, our collection here? Uh, what do we got here? Oh yeah, so when I saw that Morbius Muppet, I was like, what else could I do? So this was near to be with Oscar the Grouch on Sesame Street. Yeah, you have to put near to be or it doesn't know the right to be to do. And uh, again, this did some interesting shit. Like, you got like this one here where it like made Oscar into to be and Oscar's just like fucking freaked out. This middle one where it tried to do a to be Muppet and Oscar's again like fucking flattened. The middle right kind of did the same thing, but it looks creepy as fuck. Middle left just fucked with Big Bird, kind of fused him with Oscar. The bottom middle looks like some kind of like bad cosplayer. Like, I, I love the Oscar in the bottom left. Something about that fucking wrong knockoff Oscar really cracks me up. That that fucking face. That's, this wide he fucking looks like face. Fucking Oscar trying to dress up as Donald Trump. Wide Oscar Trump. Oh, what else we got? Uh, oh, this is Billy Mays selling the Ouya. I put in the style of an infomercial. I love how it's like got Billy Mays in the top left holding the Ouya controller. Like, I think that's pretty cool. I like how it knows kind of what the Ouya is. Because I barely remember it. Hi, right, Billy Mays here. Do you want the future of gaming at your fingertips? All of your mobile games on your home console? This is Sonic in the style, uh, sorry, Bugs Bunny in the style of Sonic. It got Sonic in there with them. Other than that, you know, kind of, again, didn't really get the faces, sort of fucked up Bugs Bunnies. This was like, this, this was Stewie Griffin eating a sundae with Arnold from Hey Arnold in the style of a watercolor. So, uh, it's got him there always eating the sundae, slightly different positions and slouching. There's, there's like a baby Stewie in the middle left, uh, and there's like a baby Arnold in the middle right. I think the most accurate one is bottom middle, but then there's no sundae, it's just him and Arnold. But it, it really focused on the Stewie. What else we got? Oh shit, I lost my place with the Uh, this is Bob. Oh, I tried to do Bob from Reboot with a handgun shooting Bonzi buddy. Like, like a lost episode of Reboot. Uh, it didn't get Bob from Reboot because it doesn't know who he is. Uh, in case you don't know, it's like some... Well, it's an old, uh, early 3D animated cartoon from the 90s. About, like, this computer world and then, like, fight viruses and shit. But I got Bonzi buddy. And it was a gun, and I thought that was kind of cool, having Bonzi Buddy with a gun. But top right one just looks like a purple man, but the rest of them are, you know, I see Bonzi Buddy. Uh, this was Bonzi Buddy on the Windows 11 desktop. So it really did some, like, watercolory abstract shit. Really tried to do the Windows 11 desktop. Bottom middle, I like how it actually has the icons in the center like Windows 11, the rest of them is just kind of doing desktops. The top right sort of Mac, but it's got the Windows. Like it's got that generic Windows background there, but Bonzi Buddy's only in these two. And the, the top middle looks like some nice abstract like watercolory kind of shit. Uh, oh, Sinon as a car in the style of cars. I think top left is the only one that actually made her into a cars car. The rest just has her with cars. Yeah, I did a lot of nice ones for Nick Cheese. Uh, this was Garfield eating a healthy salad in the style of Vaporwave. Didn't really do Garfield too well, but you can kind of, you know, you can see it's there, just not very, it's all fucked. Uh, this is one. Oh, this is Garfield in Fortnite. In Fortnite's a really good prompt too. It does like that bubbly, cartoony 3D. And I, I think Jonesy's there in the bottom middle, all fucked. Uh, I don't think Garfield's got a gun in any of them. We might have had to specify to, you know, have them pack heat. Oh, Jigglypuff with gun in San Andreas. So, got Jigglypuff. No gun. 
doesn't always know what to do with Jigglypuff. Like, top right there, one of the eyes is kind of going a little south, and middle right, it's kind of like three Jigglypuffs. Yeah, some of them are all right. Uh, this was Rick Sanchez eating a Durr burger. Uh, this guy I'm eating a hamburger. I like top middle. Really getting a mouthful there. Middle right. He, sorry, bottom right. He's like, he can't stop. He's got another one on the way. He looks pissed, but he's just gonna keep going. Uh, Guy Vieri driving a Formula One racer in the style of Vaporwave. But this is some pretty good shit. He's a little big for the car. He's like very big for the car, but it's almost like a children's like go-kart version. But it's all there. Uh, Freddy Fazbear tweaking in the style of Peppa Pig. I meant to say twerking, but uh, it did put Freddy Fazbear in, in Peppa Pig. So, but that was kind of cool. I, I like top left and bottom right specifically. Uh, I don't know what's happening in bottom middle, but I don't know if I'm allowed to show it on the stream. Oh, this was Dracula from Hotel Transylvania in like an empty, like foggy city with like blood on its face or something. And top left is pretty good, and middle left is all right. Uh, bottom right, he's just fucked. He looks like he just took a dick in the ass, and he's uh, surprised that he's enjoying it. But like some of these, I really like what they did with like the photo effects. Like there's like some brain filter. Uh, it's just like a Western omelet in a hyper-realistic style. It, it's omelets, but they don't look real. They look more like 3D. Top right looks like it's just full of hot dogs. You okay, Chris? Getting really tired. Getting really tired? Well, there's not too many more of these. Uh, this was Shrek ice skating while security tries to apprehend him. Didn't really get the security part, which really disappointed me, but we definitely got Shrek ice skating, so that was cool. Uh, I think there's like Morbius drowning in a pile of gold. Gold coins. He looks like he's really coveting his money. Oh, here's Conker with Peter Griffin. It really did not know how to do Conquer, and I could kind of say the same for Peter Griffin, but I'm sure you could probably do better Peters with the right prompts. Oh, this was Banjo Kazooie 3 being presented by, I think it was like being presented by Satoru Iwata at a Nintendo Direct or some shit, or Reggie or something, like I picked like one of those Nintendo guys. Uh, it, it just did like, I guess Banjo 3 is going to have two Banjos what it's trying to tell me. Twice the banjo. Three the fun. Uh, this is Satura Iwata as a zombie at Nintendo Direct. Only bottom left really has zombie Iwata. Uh, I, I like the Mario Cyclops in bottom right. But, uh, yeah. This was like the count from Sesame Street biting a, a child. Didn't really get the child, just some really fucked up counts. Well, this was like ukulele with a bong and bloodshot eyes. So that worked out pretty good. He's got some fucked up bongs, but they're in each one. And he's got bloodshot eyes. I think I especially like top middle and bottom middle on these. Middle right's got some interesting shit going on too. I tried really hard to get Cool Cat from Cool Cat Saves the Kids. Uh, if you haven't seen that, check that out. That's fucking hilarious. Uh, it wouldn't do it. It would just generate cool cats. Like, it just generated cats with guns and sunglasses when I tried to do Cool Cat. I, I even tried to include Derek Savage, fucking Daddy Derek, 
and I, I didn't really get them. Like, I tried a whole bunch of different things. Cool Cat saves the kids. A bunch of cats. Man in orange cat mascot suit. Like, see, I tried to get, like, more specific. So I was like, alright, that's closer. Like, I just had to describe Cool Cat. This one's got, like, a lot of UI here, but... I got him with the shirt. And, like, gradually, I got kind of closer, but... Still could not get it to do Cool Cat. Just does not know who Cool Cat is. I tried to put Cool Cat in the 3D printer. You can look that up if you want to see that fucking meme. Uh, it, did a, it did some interesting shit. It, it really tried. Oh, this is got Son of Godzilla shooting some hoops in the style of pop art. They're not pretty good. It's because Nick Cheese was watching Son of Godzilla. Adam Sandler and Kevin James in the style of Angela Anaconda. Didn't really put them in the style, but it, it kind of dropped Kevin James in there. Maybe it's trying to do Adam Sandler's face on some of those, but you can't do fucking faces, so. Uh, Baby Godzilla Popsicle, because that's what happened to him at the end. He got fucked. That's some pretty good ones. I like bottom left. That's pretty cool. Top right's like a more minimalist one. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna stop really soon here. There's some really good ones as I go further down because I get more creative. This is Chef Remy being yelled at by Gordon Ramsay. Got some good Chef Remy's, but no Gordon Ramsay. I don't know what he's got in the bottom left, but again, I don't know if it's safe for work. Uh, and then I'm gonna finish with this one, because uh, this was one of my favorite ones I've done out of all of them. Uh, this is Godzilla stepping on houses in London in the style of Wallace and Gromit. And I really like what it did. Like, it's kind of got some fucked up Gromit, uh, sorry, fucked up Wallace in the top left. And it, it really looks like he's trying to do the style. You, it's really trying to blend them in. I really like bottom right. How it did him, he's got these little tiny eyes and these big crooked teeth, and like he looks claymation, like he looks really like, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Exaggerated. And it, it did it way better than I thought it was going to, and I'm, I'm just super happy with how that one turned out. Like, I love that over exaggerated face. Like, that's cool. And you can see there's like a Wallace here, and he's. He's got like some kind of like fucking punched in fucking face. But yeah, I, I, I was pretty happy with those. So, we'll stop there for tonight because Chris is like actually asleep. I got some more of them I'll share at another time. I'll just make like an old folder so that I, I don't do any repeats. So, uh, that's it for Rome again tonight. Uh, remember to like and subscribe and comment if you liked what you saw uh let me know what your favorite fucking shitty ai generated picture was or uh share your own if you've generated some good ones and i'll, I'll see them in the comments if you managed to get this far but have yourself a wonderful night uh i don't know if we'll be back tomorrow we might not we might be too tired we'll see uh if not we'll definitely be back friday so have a great weekend